All right, in this video, I'm going to uh, spruce up the blog page a little bit. I mean, that's horrible. It's just bare bones. There's nothing in the sidebar. So it's pretty easy to get that configured. So it's bland as is, and that wouldn't help user metrics at all. So what I'm going to do is log into the dashboard again. This time I'm going to hit the Optimize Press. Actually, I need the blog settings, not the dashboard. One second. I'm looking for modules. There's the modules. All right. I'm clicking the modules. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to click the turn on the sidebar opt-in because the blog's going to get traffic when I'm done with it. And it's the posts that are going to get most of the traffic. So if I'm going to get an opt-in, I'd like to come in from the the posts as well as the index. All right, been through all this before. I'll put the thank you page in again. That'll give them instructions on what to do and how to opt in. Confirm their opt in rather. All right. Now that I save that, I need to go into under the appearance and hit widgets. I need to actually move some things into the sidebar. One of the things is that opt in, optimize press side bar opt-in that needs to go in all right and I think I'll put in a recent post as well to maybe have it display 12 or so and yeah let's do that that way when somebody hits a blog they can see a bunch of recent posts and that way that'll get click through rates so if somebody hits the blog and they like the post and they can see other recent posts as well too and as soon as somebody clicks the second page after hitting my site that's going to improve the bounce rate and remember we're about improving the bounce rate so I think we're on good pace to making this site a lot better 